lead. I Bush think it's the least he would have expected, Dave, against Game Dennis on. Priestley. He's gained a two set to nil lead with an average of 83, which, uh, whilst not bad, is not spectacular either. And Priestley's average 81 and a half, well below the capability we know that uh, he uh, 85. can attain. But uh, anyway, it's uh, so far, <laughs> that's dead right. But a little bit of work to do yet. Well, it has again, we repeat, been his finishing skill that has been a telling factor in this match. Yes, yeah, 60% uh, the checkout uh, percentage. <laughs> 85! Yes, and uh, Dennis Priestley really does has to uh, move into a different gear. It's missed doubles, and they have been costly. Sixty. Still, this crowd riveted to the play with the knowledge. And Phil Taylor, 40. a giant among sportsmen of the 90s, has to stride on to this stage with the showmanship flair that only he carries with him. Can Phil Taylor make it 9 this week? 140! Priestly performance so far that's lacked real conviction, but uh, he'll hang on in there and. Uh, 174! Della super dart there. Flies all the time. He's on a two dart finish. Although I rather think he may be attracted by the three darter, depending what Priestley does here, I suppose. 110 left. Uh, Della will go for ball here, I think. Case we saw at Manly, in similar circumstances to this earlier, not go for the ball. 16 ball now. Oh, that's, that's a bad dart. Probably going for the treble. He pulled it down into the seven. Knows that you can't afford to do that. And it's probably let Priestley in here, Dave. Should have at 51. least had a shot at ball. Mind you, Dennis Priestley's finishing 50. has been nothing to... Uh, Right home about 25% only, 50 he wants, 18 should be the first start now, double 16. Yeah. Well, Della gave him a chance, and not that he would necessarily have got the ball, but he should have had a pot at it. Second leg and, uh, is Keith to throw first, game on. Got to put that behind him now. 100! Emily Carew, one of the publicity whiz kid girls attached to the dart circuit. 55! <laughs> 136! Well, Della, after that first set. Dave uh, has really, really impressed with his scoring, no question about it. And his use of the board, no question he's used around the treble 20. The evidence is there to be seen. But he's been pretty effective in other areas too. 140! Thinking there, Della, because uh, 100 would have left him on a bogey, 165, so switch to 18s on a three dart finish. 
Well, you mentioned the word motivation before. He certainly, certainly winding himself up there, isn't he? No shortage of motivation in this fella. 97. We saw Heidella made sure he left himself a finish, but Priestley hasn't got a finish, so he knows that uh, Della will be back for 70 to level up the set. Not for the first time in this match. It's at least the second time I've seen him on 166, although one has to say, Dave, that previously he was on 306, so, you know, he couldn't really have done much about it. I suppose the... 134! ...thing is not to leave yourself on 306. Need to require 70. again for Priestley, so to go two lengths to nil up in this vital, vital third set. Standing still, not moving at all, nose half an inch inside there. Crucial dart. They're all crucial, aren't they? Well, match now beginning. Ladies and gents, can you not shout out while the, take while the players are actually throwing? Thank you. The different guys. Yes, and Keith Dunner, who's so finishing, was up at 100% and Game then at on. 70%, is now back at 50% because he missed two darts there. And that was with the throw. So he has given Priestley hope, a glimmer. I wonder if Priestley has got his foot in the door, 100. whether he'll kick it open, John. Yes, well, anything you can do when you're two sets to nil down, and it sounds obvious, I know, but he's thinking in terms of the next set, winning, got to win it, win it. So far, Priestley is. Then worry about the next one after that. And uh, we've seen that happen a number of times today, three matches of the... The ones we've had today so far have been 2-0 to one player and then the other players come back to 2 all. As it turns out, Dave, they've all eventually gone to the player who took the lead. But 140! <laughs> 43! Just pulled a little to the right there, Della, the third dart into treble one. Thirty six. Well, already in the second round, Jamie Harvey, 85. John Lowe, they'll meet on Saturday. Dave Askew and Alex Roy. They'll meet on Saturday. Richie Burnett, who'll play the winner of this game again on Saturday. Les Fitton, who will play the winner of our next match on the final game of the day. The reigning champion, Phil Taylor, against Nigel Justice. 85! Already many have said that justice will be done. Nigel will be hoping that in another sense... 100! Dennis should require 140. Free sleep then to wrap up the set and get back into the game. It's a possibility. One hundred. Well, rather <laughs> well, Cliff Lazarenko and Jamie Harvey, two of our battle-scarred warriors. 100. Yes, Harvey was involved in a cliffhanger and earlier. Cliffs in speed. action tomorrow. Play Scott going, Cummings, yeah. the Canadian. That'll be a good one. Tops for the set for Priestley in straight legs. Inching, half inching his way down. Yes, Into the double, which it. takes. Priestley to within one set of Della. The third set is a little bit of animation from Dennis Priestley for the first time. Can't wait for the return.
in a few moments' time. So I hit the road and made my getaway. Restless feeling, I really got a 